Right now, health experts and leaders in Beloit are urging the EPA to implement new safeguards for protection against gas plants. Madison Rios has you covered on how they say these plants could affect nearby communities. Today, health experts in Beloit highlighted what they call the dangerous health effects of gas plants to surrounding communities. But one health expert was unable to make it. Her nephew is in critical condition fighting a respiratory illness. One cause for respiratory illnesses is poor air quality. So they said the conference was dedicated to him and it gave Healthy Climate Wisconsin even more of a reason to fight for protection. If we had cleaner air and the faster we have cleaner air in Wisconsin, the less likely we will have childhood hospitalizations for respiratory illness like this because we know that pollution is directly related to respiratory and cardiovascular illness. Healthy Climate Wisconsin's Executive Director, Abby navinska Lois tells me what change she is looking for for the future of Beloit. What I hope to see in Beloit is a community where everybody has a chance to thrive. And right now that means getting rid of fossil fuel pollution in the local area. That means renewable energy, bikeable communities, healthy foods. And all of that needs to really be decided from the community itself. She says the air quality in Beloit communities near the gas plant sometimes measure near 150, which is in the unhealthy category. Zero to 50 is considered to be good. And everybody needs to be able to weigh in on the decisions that impact their families and their health. I reached out to the EPA for comment but have not yet heard back. Reporting in Beloit, Madison Rios, 27 News.